the world has gone completely apeshit. The final official full-length Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens trailer has been released. And <laughs> I have no words, really. I just got done watching it. I'm going to give you just some quick, quick things that I picked up from the trailer. This is my, um, I guess you can call it my reaction video. I'm sure most of you listening to this have already seen the trailer or you've looked it up. Um, or if you haven't, I am going to put a link down below so you can go watch this trailer. Just visually, this thing looks incredible. Uh, Star Wars has maybe never looked this good. Uh, every shot looks to be put together with such pristine detail. Nothing looks fake or CGI'd. Uh, it all looks very, very authentic. Now, what I picked up from this, a couple of quick points I wanted to talk about. Number one, no Luke Skywalker in this trailer, and he's also not in the poster. We know for a fact that Mark Hamill's in the movie because he is listed not only in the cast, but he's also listed in uh there's that leaked picture i mean he was there in tanisha filming i mean we know he's there uh but now he's nowhere to be found in the trailer and he's nowhere to be found uh in the poster so clearly the spoilers that have been going around and this is not really a major spoiler i'm about to say but uh kylo not kylo Ray, Finn, and Han Solo are looking for Luke Skywalker in this movie, and they're probably not going to find him until Act 3. So that's the talk. Now, what I found very interesting about the movie is that it seems like what happened in between Star Wars uh, Return of the Jedi and this film is that I guess the Battle of Endor was kind of forgotten about, or at least maybe not forgotten about, but certainly the involvement of the Jedi and the Sith were forgotten about because there's several voiceovers and monologues here from Han Solo where he's like, yes, it's true, the Jedi, the Sith, the dark side, the light side, or whatever the hell he says. Um... All that stuff, like it's almost as if, like you know, it became kind of that ancient religion again, you know, like it was in A New Hope. It's, I almost feel like they're going through through that route again. Uh, that after thirty years, people have forgotten the Jedi even existed. You know, it seems to be like that again. Um, very interesting stuff. Also, Kylo Ren is the one holding the mask of Darth Vader, and he's basically saying, I'm going to finish what you started, which, again, I'm not really sure what that means because Vader did take over the galaxy with the Emperor for a little bit of time. They did rule the galaxy. What more did he want to do? Wipe out all the Jedi? Maybe he's also hunting for Luke Skywalker. Maybe he wants to find Luke Skywalker and kill him. Uh, or maybe people think Skywalker's dead. I don't know. But the trailer just looked incredible. Um, just, you know, we saw shots, action shots of the, the battle on the ice planet. Uh, we saw some Stormtrooper action. We saw the teaser for Kylo Ren versus Finn's lightsaber duel. And then we saw the beautiful scene of Han Solo and Princess Leia apparently reuniting and hugging. Just a fantastic trailer. Go check it out. Thanks for watching the video. And we're going to have a whole lot more to talk about in the coming weeks. So stay tuned to the channel. and We'll have a great discussion. And I'll catch you down the road.